What is going on guys, it is your boy Big Dylan, back at it again with another Destiny video. In today's video, we're going to be discussing a topic called Titan Skating. Now let's get into the class setup. What you're going to want is high armor. This is going to be the main thing you're going to want to prioritize in your subclass build. And you're also going to want the increased control jump. You can have this set up on all three of the Titan subclasses. So don't feel like you're limited to a certain subclass. Now, getting into the basics, Titan Skating is running forward and spamming air pretty much as fast as you can. This is what I'm doing right now, as you can see on screen. And basically what it does is it enables you to travel very fast. Like, to cover ground before any other of the classes can in the game. Uh, Titans are the fastest class in the game right now um, they sh probably shouldn't be but they are um, Titan skating does help you a lot say if I'm in PvP one of my teammates gets somebody one shot I call them out I skate over and I clean them up straight away Titan skating enables you to close the gap very very easily um, it's probably the most effective in speed runs in PvE and obviously PvP it, on a competitive level is very good. Right, so now let's get to Twilight Garrison Skating. This is the most commonly used one I would say. Um, as you can see it basically gives you a thrust. Now this thrust gives you an instant boost of momentum for Titan Skating. It enables you to change angles very quickly. I messed it up there but you know. <laughs> but basically it's very good. Titan Twilight Garrison Skating is probably the best. I use it all the time. I use it over shoulder charge skating and basic skating any day. Just the instant boost of momentum if you want to change angle very quickly helps you a lot um, now shoulder charge skating is pretty much the same but it's a lot a lot harder to do um, there's a perfect window to activate your jump out of your shoulder charge to propel you forward now I'm not very good at shoulder charge skating at all I never do it um, I prefer to twat garrison skate because it's easier um, but if you can perfect the shoulder charge skate um, it is very good obviously it frees up an exotic slot you could use a you know dual grenade chest piece instead or some other sort of exotic whatever you want but basically shoulder charge skating is the exact same but it's just harder to proc obviously you, you jump now obviously if you want to practice this you'll end up realizing it very quickly um, obviously messing up your jumps and stuff like that but now let's get into agility affecting the height of your jump now a lot of people don't know this but agility does affect your jump height you can see I'm running max armor and I only just make it up onto the top of the building I'm going to change my armor, I'm going to lower it and put more agility on now what this does is it increases my jump height now this time I'll end up getting all the way up on top of the building as you can see very easily just made it but I still made it now this is a perfect example of agility affecting your jump height and helping you skate up an incline that's a perfect example of using agility to an advantage now this is an example of using a heavy weapon aka a rocket launcher or a sleeper stimulant a heavy you know heavy weapon that is going to lower your agility even further and keep you closer to the floor and all in all guys what it comes down to is constant practice obviously i've been trying to titan skate for over a year now obviously i've got better at it over time obviously it's just constant constant practice you know start off at the basics maybe you know once you've got the basics down add a twilight garrison add a shoulder charging you know build it up don't just start at the max you know you want to there is a art to it and i wish you all the best in your titan skating and thanks peace